The water was the perfect temperature for this year's Zorba's Gold Lake Swim Challenge. The annual competition has consistently been getting larger every year, and this year they had a record number of participants. Our Logan Gay has more on the challenge. Go! And they're off. This year's Zorba's Gold Lake Challenge has 70 swimmers participate. That makes this the largest number of contestants the event has seen since it was created three years ago. I just wanted to put on a fun race. I, I, I do the Ironman stuff and I, I do races and I thought it would be a, a cool thing to bring to the Brainerd area. So we created it. Every year the event is put on to honor the memory of avid swimmer Peter Johnson. All the proceeds from the event are donated to the Brainerd Warriors. He gave back a whole lot, and, and this is just a way that we can recognize him. We make a donation every year back to the uh, the, the swim teams in the area in, in his name. The race consists of a 2.4 and a 1.2 mile race, and it has become a worthy competition for competitive swimmers. A lot of these people are experienced, and you know, when we see the 2.4 people come in, these people are fast. We have some very serious athletes that we're fortunate. And the race has become a fan favorite for our four-legged swimmers as well. I claimed it on a shoulder injury a couple of years ago when he beat me to the line, and I saw him around the corner. He cuts the corner a little bit on me. He knows the route, so he was cheating on me. I looked up, and I saw him in front of me. I had to put the hammer down just a little bit to get in front of him. And at the end of the race, all the participants were welcome to enjoy refreshments from Zorba's. In this wall, Logan Gay, Lakeland News. The Zorba's Gold Lake Challenge raised at least $1,000 this year to donate to the Brainerd Warriors swim team. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.